Yo guys, this is Clay here, back with another YouTube video, and today we're going to be checking out the best stoner class setup in Black Ops Cold War. Yo guys, before we get into today's class setup, if you could hit that sub button if you're new, we are so close to 2,000 subscribers. And also hit that like button. Hitting the like button is the easiest way to support my channel and it pushes the video out into YouTube algorithm so other people can see it. Another way to help out with the YouTube algorithm is to comment something in the comments. It could be about the video or it could be about the gameplay or it could just be a random emoji. Anything helps. Jumping into the class setup, this is my best five attachment stoner class setup. On the optic, I am going to be using the two times scope, but this is all preference. You can use whichever one feels most comfortable. On the muzzle, I'm going to be using the AGC suppressor to stay out the mini map and for the 12% add to the vertical recoil control. It does take down 30% to the effective damage range and negative 25% to the bullet velocity but we're going to be using the task force barrel for the 8% added to the damage 100% to the effective damage range and 41% to the bullet velocity in order to control the recoil that is on the cons of the task force barrel you want to put on the field agent grip it adds 8% to the vertical recoil and 30% to the horizontal it still has a little bit of recoil but if you can control it this is a really good class setup on the handle we're going to be using the airborne elastic grab for the 30% aimed on side time 90% flinch resistance and to also aim while going prone if you guys end up trying this class setup out and you like it or if you change some attachments around let me know what those are in the comments have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button and I'll see you in the next one. I didn't even want to play Nuketown, but it just so happened to pop up in my quick play. And it was either this or Echelon, and I'm definitely going to pick Nuketown. He came back? I thought he was just going to... Okay. Yeah, don't challenge me whenever I have a stunner. That guy's gonna end up getting mad, but... I hate to break it to you, buddy. <laughs> Got into a lobby with a pretty sweaty guy. We're just gonna sit here and use our war machine. I mean, what are they gonna do? Gonna kill this guy up here. Confused on why teammates didn't get B. Why they waited so long. There's a nuke right there. I'm gonna let them kill me. Guess not, never mind. Alright, finally. Now we can go on another little tear. <clears throat> Five 
I think I got my kill to, uh, taken. No! Uh, how weird are you? Uh, I could have had a tr I could have had a quad nuke. We can still definitely do it. Where? Where? Where was I getting shot at? Uh, he's sitting in the back of the map. Nice. I think he's talking about where I died off my nuke. Marking waypoint coordinates. <clears throat> Secure the objective. Take I hope he's happy Take about that. Enemy has alpha. See locked down. War machine available. How? I shot the war machine right next to him. I'm gonna get a double nuke for sure. I'll just spawn trap right here. Okay, well, that's such a good first half. Teammates, you don't have to get on the flags. We're winning. We're winning. We'll, we will win. They're pulling out stoners now, I think. The radar jammers are cringe. Hang on here. With a thermal, bro. Losing 
Get off the ground. Sitting in a corner, bro, that's so cringe. Spawn trap them for the double nuke. 135 and 10 GG's.